Hi, friends, and welcome to Tabletop Tonight. It's uh, Monday Fun Day. Um, I want to thank you for joining us tonight. My name is Ruel Gaviola, and as always, well, not as always, lately it's been pretty tough to get everyone together, <laughs> but uh, my wife, Michelle, Hello. is my co-host tonight. I'm so happy to have you here. Um, we're going to play a fun game tonight. This is Plankton Rising from the Op. But before we get to the game, we want to welcome everyone again to the stream. We do this every Monday through Thursday at 7 p.m. Pacific. So thank you for joining us wherever you may be. I saw a bunch of uh, familiar names in chat. So thank you, friends. I've got uh, Meeple Overboard. Yeah, uh, Chris and Wannabe Kiwi. Thank you so much for joining us. Wannabe Kiwi did a fantastic job at Renegade Con this last week. And she was all over the place teaching games, hanging out. So amazing. Thank you, Susie. Um, also, see Dalfon, um, our friend Slackfish, as always. Thank you, Slackfish. James is here. I even saw Ella. Ella, thanks for joining us. I'm not sure what time it is down under. I I believe you're like 15, 16 hours ahead of us. So thank you. And um, welcome from the future. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Marlon's in the house. Yes, Marlon right there. Uh, that's that's all we're going to talk about tonight. Um, it's the late. But did you know that the Lakers won their 17th world championship last night? Who? Yeah, right. You didn't know. <laughs> Friends, I am so fired up. I mean, my family and I, we are lifelong Laker fans. I mean, it actually goes generations of my family. Uncle, dad, cousins, <laughs> brothers, friends, family, family friends. We're just, we're diehard Laker fans. And so last night was a huge night. The Lakers won their 17th NBA championship, tying us with, uh, again, us, because I am part of the team. Um, <laughs> Tying us with the our heated rivals, the Boston Celtics. So shout out to the Lakers. Shout out to all of my fellow Lakers fans out there in Laker Nation. Um, yes, we. And you know what? I mean, LeBron James and the Anthony Davis, amazing. I'm not gonna. You know, this is a board game stream. If you want to listen? If you want to hear me just ramble on about sports, I can do that. But I don't want to. I want to play this game. This is gonna be fun. Um, it's 1 p.m. out in Australia. Okay. Well, uh, good afternoon, Ella. Thank you for joining us. Um, we have, I have a family in, gosh, is it Queensland? I think, yeah, Queensland. I have some family out there. Um, but thank you for joining us. Uh, Chris, I saw Chris um, in, from Meeple over here. Distant Babble's in the house. Thank you, Distant Babble. And it, it's so cool to have Ella join us from the future, right, friends? So <laughs> shout out Ella in the comments, friends. <laughs> Slackfish is getting real technical. LA, Minnesota, if you're going to count the 17, yes. LA slash Minnesota Lakers. We, got, we had five uh, from Minnesota. And like whenever my Celtic friends, fans bring that up, I also remind them that the Celtics won a majority of their championships when there was only like six teams in the league. So they had like a way better shot. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, so <laughs> we're not going to get into that. Um, yes, uh, Ella's got the right idea. See, this is the future talking friends. Go Lakers. Um, let's, uh, you know what, uh, Michelle and I, before we came on air, we were talking about something um, that I'd like to bring up. We haven't done this in a while. Um, when we first started streaming here, actually on Facebook, we were doing it every day just as a way to hang out, you know, as a family, me, Michelle, and Lauren. Um, and then we would, you know, have our friends from Facebook just hang out and family as well. So it's just when the, you know, pandemic first hit, it was a really great way of just staying connected, right? And keeping the checking on each other, you know, mental health wise and stuff. Mm -hmm. And, you know, we haven't really talked about that. I mean, things have sort of gotten back to normal a little bit or a little more normal than it was back in March. But, you know, I would like to, you know, bring that up again. Like, mental health wise i mean we're doing okay but yeah. you would just you would come across something earlier today that you wanted to share right yeah i guess i'm like a part of like a bunch of different like teacher groups and i read a post today well and there have been you know quite a few actually about you know teachers that are like totally stressed out and like there was a lot of detail and you know just check on your teacher friends yeah because this is i mean i'm just fortunate enough to um be an independent studies teacher so it wasn't too much of a change but you know there are it's it's definitely more work but for those teachers that are in the classroom and either you know doing all virtual or all online i mean or hybrid <laughs> oh my gosh it, it's like too much yeah. too it's just too stressful yeah so yeah check on your teacher friends yeah i Make mean sure they're okay right yeah teacher friends especially they're and you know they're doing i mean it's a whole new world obviously yeah. you know, nowadays so you know you've been you know very fortunate that you've been able to transition you know 
pretty smoothly yeah. right, compared to yeah. other teachers that we know. But yeah, friends, I mean, check on your friends and family. I mean, it doesn't take much to reach out these days, uh, either through social media or why not try an old school phone call maybe or text yeah. or something. Um, but yeah, take care of each other. Stay safe out there. Um, yeah, Slackfish is a great point. So yes, thank you, Game Jedi. Uh, kudos to the teachers this year. Oh, fried chickens in the house. Thank you, fried chickens. And even for veteran teachers, it's like starting all over again, I'm sure. This is year 18. Yeah. And it's for me, just this format has made me had to start over with a lot of things. And mm -hmm. I mean, just luckily, just like I do have that experience under my belt, but yeah. not with virtual distance learning. Mm -hmm. you know? uh, fried chicken says it's been a weird year for me. Teach third grade and we're face to face. <gasps> Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. I love third grade. That I taught third grade for five years. Mm -hmm. Some oh, fun experiences there. Uh, Ella says, I hope you all stay safe. Teachers are a really hard job. I believe uh, yeah. Ella was a teacher um, back in the day as well. Yeah. So, yeah, teachers and anyone, I mean, essential workers too, just stay safe. You know, it's just a little reminder. We haven't talked about it in a while just because, you know, um, well, we haven't been doing streams. It's been mainly me these days um, mm -hmm. just because of schedules and stuff. But, yeah. yeah, it's just, you know, take care of each other. Take care of yourselves. You know, stay safe. So, uh, oh. uh, fried chicken oh. is the best thing. <laughs> Uh, Meeple Overbird said, daughters in Canada, we are getting that teacher lots of gift cards. Yes, <laughs> that's one way to take care of them. Well, well said, Chris. Um, Meeple Overbird said, teaching 40. I can't even imagine. I can't even imagine. That. Oh, goodness. Marlon goodness. also, yeah, it's definitely been different. I feel for the older generation faculty professors who are having difficulty adjusting to your tech. Yeah, Marlon, you know, he does uh, tech stuff, and I know he's had some experience, firsthand experience with that, you know, trying to get you know, teachers who aren't used to the tech stuff. I mean, yeah. if you've been around, you're tenured, you've been, you know, doing stuff and all of a sudden, okay, now you have to teach via Zoom. That is just, you know, that's, that's got to be a difficult task. So kudos to all the teachers out there. Um, yeah. So as we always do here, let, I'm just going to transition right out the heck out of that. Stream snacks, friends. What are y'all eating? What are y'all drinking? Um, I've got uh, LaCroix, as always. This time I'm going with the lime flavor. Uh, what about you, Michelle? You got anything happening oh. over there? I have aloe. I haven't had this in a while, mm. but um, yeah, there's a lot of sugar in it. But <laughs> I think I'm gonna drink about half of it tonight. Gotta be careful. I, I don't know. It's just it's just something yummy. Yeah, you know. I, I never. I, I mean, I I like aloe. I, I've never. I wasn't a big fan of it like you and Lauren because I knew you and Lauren go through you know a lot. Oh of this yeah. Stuff. Yeah. Uh, Sackfish, do you get any personalized, Michelle? I'm noticing on my work that getting some days to myself where I can just catch up, prepare for the rest of my work is super helpful. I actually, I do get personal days. Um, I haven't used any so far mm -hmm. and I don't, it's, it's different with independent studies because, um, you know, I, I, even when we were, um, you know, going to the classroom, I could still, you know, work from home. It, it didn't matter. Yeah. You know, if I was sick, I'm like, yeah, I can, I can, you know, reset your test. Nice. Or if you have a simple question, you know, I can answer that on, you know, with email or chat or whatever. Mm -hmm. uh, Marlon, this is, this sounds awesome. Uh, Jula made uh, ube tres leches that's frozen. So now it's basically ube ice cream cake. Oh my <laughs> God. Sounds freaking fantastic, <laughs> man. Uh, what was it on Instagram or something? Yeah. Wow, nice. Uh, Game Jedi, I'm assuming this is Patrick, Game Jedi 84. He's got Coke Zero. I know he's a big Coke Zero fan. Disembello has celery and peanut butter. Oh, cool. Very. Uh, that's very old school. You don't have ants on your log. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right? Ants on the, it was like raisins, is it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, raisins. Yeah. On the, yeah. Uh, wannabe Kiwi has a black tea with condensed milk. Very nice. Ooh. Yeah. Um, so yeah, thanks for sharing your st um, stream snacks, folks. Normally, Amanda Panda is our chat moderator. She's actually streaming on her channel right now. Oh, um, yeah, with the with, yeah with the girls' game shelf. So um, I'm gonna ask y'all to keep things PG-13. She's not here to bust out the band hammer. I don't know how to do it. So um, ha have at it, folks. <laughs> Wait, game Jedi 84 is not Patrick. Oh, it's not Patrick. Okay, I'm female. Oh, okay, sorry, Game Jedi 84. I thought it was uh, my my uh, friend Patrick, but but he also likes Coke Zero. He, he also likes Coke Zero, so thank you. And he loves uh, Star Wars, so that's why I got confused. But thank you for joining us. Um, we are going to be playing. Let me actually got to take care of some business. Oh, Ella's having a chocolate chai soy latte, very Melbourne. I did not know there was a Melbourne thing. 
That sounds good, though. Uh, <laughs> let me take care of some business here, folks. Yeah. Uh, I do want to shout out our Patreon supporters. Thank you to all of them. And I want a special shout out to our all access and very important gamer patrons, Kevin, Mike, Patrick, and Jeff. Much appreciated. Also want to thank our sponsor, as always. One of our main sponsors here on the channel is doo -doo -doo -doo, Van Ryder Games. Please check out Van Ryder Games at vanridergames.com. The other way. <laughs> yeah. Uh, our other sponsor, as always, is Holly Chu. <laughs> Holly does all the artwork and our emotes here on uh, Twitch, so please visit her at hollychuart.com. That's Chu with a... C-H-I-U. Thank you. <laughs> That's like Lauren's job right there. <laughs> and we do have a special sponsor for today, The Op, USA Opley. I want to thank them. Hi. <laughs> uh, thank them for sponsoring the show as well. In fact, uh, they are the reason why we have this game. Um, I'm going to put that there. Whoops. Got to move that. Move. Okay. <laughs> Everybody move. <laughs> you like that? That's, that's Andre the Giant in Princess Bride. Everybody move. It's okay. <laughs> Sounds just like him. <laughs> yes, that's uh, C-H-I-U. Yeah, love Holly's illustrations. Hostage Negotiator, fantastic solo game from Van Ryder. Uh, you know what? This is funny. Okay, Disembabble. I was totally thinking of that earlier. It looks like the old OP Ocean Pacific uh, clothing line yeah. a little bit, right? So I don't know if that was uh, on purpose or what, but uh, the op. That's what OP stands for, on purpose. On purpose, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, the op. I always heard them as the OP. This is like, yeah, USA Opoly, right, Chris? Uh, yeah. Sunshiny74, thank you for joining us. Love all the little hugging meeples. Very nice. And uh, we are being raided, Ooh. folks. So if you're new to the channel, when we get raided, we bust <laughs> up the raiding hat. Here is the raiding hat. You know, I can't take off liquor. Sorry. <laughs> you know, no, it's a special it's a special occasion. Uh, friends, I want to thank, uh, I don't know who raided, but uh, thank you, uh, Kiwi. Uh, yes, uh, just like Fezzik, right? Sound just like him. I want to thank our raider friends. Thank you for raiding. Uh, my name is Ruel Gaviola. I'm here with my wife, Michelle. Hello. And we stream here on uh, Twitch Monday through Thursday, 7 p.m. Pacific. We play board games. We're analog games, but sometimes we'll play digital implementations of board games. So thank you for the raid. And this is the raiding hat just for you. You made this for me way back in the day, like <laughs> March, right? In the before times. Yeah, before times. <laughs> uh, do you want to share how you made this? And It's a simple manila folder and duct tape. Oh, well, you know what? Oh, yes, and the Christmas tinsel. Yeah. Leftover Christmas tinsel. Leftover Christmas tinsel, <laughs> duct tape, and a manila folder. I mean, she works her magic, folks. It's amazing. Did you, uh, it was like on Pinterest or something? The, yeah, I just Googled it. Yeah. Ta-da! Ta-da! Thank you, Board Game House, for rating us. And this is for you, my friends. Appreciate it. And Slackfish has gifted a sub to, I believe it's a game, Jedi A4. So, friends, another thing we do here. We are old school. I don't have any of the fancy alerts set up. So whenever someone gets gifted a sub, we do an alert, alert. There's a new subscription. Thank you, Slackfish, as always, for your support. Um, it is a gift sub. So what do I do? Oh, here it is. Uh, we do the gift thing. Gift, 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 gift. Thank you, Slackfish. It's a gift sub, folks. If you want to subscribe, Please feel free or gift uh, another one, a, a someone else, a uh, sub as well. Gift but it forward. Gift it forward, yes. And thank you, Slack, which is always, yes. It's so much fun, you know, doing that. It's <laughs> it's silly, but you know what? That's what board games is all about. Where There's enough stuff going on in the world. No, we're not going to worry about it now. We're yeah. going to play some games. So let's start talking about this here. I'm going to, um, I want to get this thing going here. So tonight we are playing Plankton Rising. So Plankton Rising is now available for pre-order from the op. And I just checked to make sure the game will be out November 10th. Okay, so you got about a month or so, um, but you can pre-order it now. Just go to the website. Um, and I think Michelle dropped in the link earlier, actually, uh, using one of those cool little ninja bot commands. Um, here is the game, folks. Uh, don't mind the mic and stuff, but here we are. It's a cooperative dice chucking slash set collection game. Okay. Um, yeah. A game Jedi asks the all important question who lives in a pineapple under the sea? We're Sponge not. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I thought you were queuing me. <laughs> I'm queuing our friends um, uh, out there. 
I don't want to say I, I don't want to say because I don't want any kind of copyright strikes. But yes, sing along at home, folks. <laughs> Throw in that music. We all know the lyrics. Um, yes, Sponge, SpongeBob SquarePants. Here we are. Um, this is the Krusty Krab, the kitchen and the dining room. That's two areas. Uh, we are playing against our rival Plankton at the Chum Bucket. Okay, so Plank, um, Plankton, what we're he's trying to do is mess us up by stealing the ingredients to the crusty burger. You'll notice here that there are a bunch of slots for the cubes here. Whenever one gets filled up uh, by plankton, we're gonna switch, uh, flip it over. Um, and then anytime we have to go to this ingredient, we're gonna activate a power for plankton. So if plankton gets all six of these parts of the burger, he wins. Uh, he also wins if he defeats 10 of our friends. Okay, these are some of the friends. Um, and if one of us, Michelle and I each start with one friend in our um, on our team, if he defeats all the team members on one of our teams, we also lose. How do we win? Great question, Ruel. To win, we Michelle and I, between us, we have to complete seven orders, okay? So the three different types of cards here, you'll see friends such as uh, Sandy Cheeks, you'll see orders such as King, uh, Kelp Rings, or a Krabby Patty. There's also villains in the deck. Um, I'm not, uh, they're already randomly in there. You'll see them as they pop up. Um, so we have to try to defeat the villains as well. Uh, Wacky Tabaxi Tavern. Is it Tabaxi? <laughs> Is it Tabaxi? I don't know. Welcome, uh, Fred. Thank you for joining us. Um, so what we do on our turn, there are four steps. We're going to place our team token. So I am Team SpongeBob, and that's the SpongeBob token. Michelle, who are you today? I am Squidward. Michelle Squidward. Where's, where's the camera? Oh, yep, right this there. is my token. I get a trophy right off the bat. <laughs> All right, nice. And I, I am um, got a buff arm. So what <laughs> I do is on my turn, I'm going to either choose the kitchen or the dining room. Um, and the where you go matters because if I go to the uh, kitchen, I, I am going to be dealing with these characters or cards. If I go up here, I'm going to deal with those cards, okay? So then after I choose, I'm going to flip and resolve a Plankton card. We'll talk about that in a second. Basically, the Plankton card is going to place Plankton either here in the kitchen or here in the uh, dining room or in the chum bucket. The chum bucket is just off the table here. Um, that just means he's you know doing his nefarious deeds. Um, we're going to resolve the Plankton token. If there's anything here that we need to resolve because of Plankton, we will do that. And then we're going to roll the friend dice, depending on what we have in front of us. So I start with uh, two reds and a yellow. Uh, Michelle, what do you start with? I start with two reds and a green. Okay. So those are the starting dice that we have. As we collect more friends onto our team, we're going to be able to get more dice and or more special abilities. Okay. So if you're familiar with, uh, let me do this thing here. If you're familiar with any of the rising games from the op, we have Star Trek. No, no, that's Star Trek Panic. Um, we have uh, uh, the, gosh, what is it? The Thanos one. Thanos Rising, the Avengers one. There's also the Harry Potter one, which um, we played before here. Uh, there is now a Batman Who Laughs one, and this is another one. So there's like four. There's actually a fifth one that's not available in North America, unfortunately. It is the Star Wars um, Rising, which I want because it has a Darth Vader figure. But these uh, games are pretty, they pretty much have the same core, like, foundation. We are cooperatively trying to defeat, you know, the bad guy, basically, uh, using dice and set collections. So, um, yeah, it, it's it's a lot of fun. I, I've enjoyed them all. Uh, my favorite, of course, is the Marvel one. But I know if we got that Star Wars one. Oh, hint, hint. Anyone out in North America want to send me one? <laughs> I'll be your BFF. Uh, so in this game, we're trying to defeat Plankton. He's going to go to different areas, and then Michelle and I are going to roll dice, and you're trying to match symbols. The symbols that you match, you will either complete that order, or you will take the friend into your hand as a um, friend that gives you abilities or dice, or you will defeat a villain. Okay, so again, we're trying to complete seven orders. There's a one. There's like three orders out there already, and a bunch of our friends. So um, yeah, so that's the game. That's Pretty much it. Oh, Game Jet, I bought one from Canada. Nice. You know, that's what I should probably do. Um, oh, thank you. Yeah, Thanos is the, uh, the one that I almost forgot. You said that. Oh, okay. Yeah. Thank you. So, yes, uh, let's get to the game. Uh, again, this is Plankton Rising from the Op. Thanks to the Op for sponsoring this episode, along with our other uh, ongoing sponsors. And, Michelle, would you like to go first or should I go first? I'll go first. Okay. Michelle's okay, going to start so off. So I place my token in a location. I'm going to put it in the dining room. Okay. Um, 
Flip and resolve a plankton card. Okay, there's the plankton cards right there. Okay, so this is the dining room, so homie needs to go there. Okay, here's plankton going to the dining room. Ah, okay, I don't know and... what's on this. <laughs> Uh, okay. We are adding a theft cube. Okay, hold on a second. Okay, we have a pug sighting, I think, folks. Uh, Bruno's knocking at the door. If you haven't been here before, Bruno is our pug. Um, sometimes he comes in here, sometimes he doesn't. I think he just wants to, like, you know, say hi. But then he, he's in here. I don't know if he wants to be on camera. We'll, we'll see. But anyway, so Michelle's drawing the dining room tart. We placed plankton in the dining room. We have placed a theft token here on the um, top of the bun. And then we just discard that. Oh, oh. Okay. Oh, hello. He okay. wants to come up. All right. Bruno wants to say hi. I will switch cameras. So, friends, this is Bruno. Uh, Michelle's. Oh, does he want to come up? No, no, he doesn't want to. Okay. okay. Well, maybe later, friends. Uh, bye, Bruno. Oh, sweet boy. <laughs> okay. Where was I? <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Kiwi. Yeah, I love Bruno. And you, friends, feel free to use the emotes. Yeah, Slackfish, there's the Bruno emotes, folks. Okay, roll and assign friend dice. So I get my two reds and the green. Mm -hmm. Okay. Bruno, do you want to see? <laughs> Bruno's like, what the heck? Okay, so I have two BFFs and a trophy. Okay. Okay, so I got to see if I match any in this business. Yeah. So again, Michelle is in the dining room area, so she's trying to get those cards up there. Ooh, I can get the... Um, the kelp rings. Oh, okay. Michelle has okay. completed an order already. Nice. Okay. okay. So if plankton is present, no spatula, unless the order is completed. Oh, uh, okay. Completed, right? Sorry. I, yeah, I forgot about plankton. He came in here, so we're supposed to trigger any abilities. So this means basically if you complete this, normally you complete an order, you get a special spatula card, but you're going to complete this. You will not get that. Uh, once per turn, what is this? If plankton, okay, if plankton is present, Plus one um, time to each friend here. Oh, okay. Bummer. So Plankton is here. Because he's here, you're going to put oh, two. Yeah, I forgot about that, too. So you put um, the cubes. And because of this power, we get an additional cube. Ooh, yeah. Oh, ouch. Yeah. So this game, um, it, they call it time instead of, like, health. So, because no one's like really going to get hurt, right? In SpongeBob, but um, the time means if you run out of time, that card is eliminated, and that means um, SpongeBob or I mean Plankton has defeated one of your friends. So they're halfway home here. Um, Michelle has one more die to roll, so let's do this. Michelle has well done. You have served the kelp rings. Okay, where does this go? Do I just keep it? Uh, yeah, it just keeps it okay. side over there. And I roll this one. Yeah, this one gets refilled. Yeah, I don't know if it has enough okay, to do anything. I have one BFF. No. No. Okay. Cool. So, Michelle, that was the fourth step. She resolved for friend dice and finishes her turn. Uh, finishing turn is just basically taking your um, team token back. And then I will go. Good turn. Uh, the naive cube plankton. in. You know, I don't. I'm not really that familiar with um, SpongeBob, so I'm gonna. We're gonna rely on you at home, friends, uh, with all these SpongeBob quotes. Would Lauren know any of these SpongeBob things? No, she probably would. Yeah. She probably would. Okay. That was her era. Nice. Uh, I'm gonna go down. Okay, that one gives you a blue die. Um. So yeah, some of these give you blue dice, folks. So I'm going to go down here because if I can get this one, the Grubby Grouper, I can get a free reroll. Uh, our um, also on our so I start with SpongeBob. If I roll these symbols, I can trigger that ability. Uh, Michelle has a different one for Squidward, and also on our player um, sheets, our home sheets, we have powers that can be activated here. So if I did one of the effort. Um, icons, I can subtract a time from any friend. So those friends have two. I can just use this ability to take those off so they uh, oh. survive. Yeah. But uh, could you flip over a plankton um, card for me, please? Yep. Okay. So kitchen. Okay. And um, the oh, top button. Top button. Okay. There's two traps or two theft tokens there already, folks. Okay. So now <laughs> plankton. Um, <laughs> I love it. I, you know, we don't have a pun meter. Uh, maybe we do. Can you, I don't know if y'all can do it through uh, Nightbot. I don't know if it's um, hyphen pun but, or, I mean, explanation pun. But, yes, you two are always krilling it. Thank you, Disembabble. That's one pun. Thank you. <laughs> uh, the Grizzly right Dis. In the air. <laughs> <laughs> the older I get, the more I start to think that Squidward was actually the good guy and SpongeBob and Patrick were terrorists. <laughs> 
<laughs> I've never heard about them before. Grizzly Viz, by the way, I love your um, avatar. Well, I, I love the Dodger hat. Well done, my friend. Uh, go Dodgers, by the way. I, I don't know what the score would be. Uh, Bueller gave up a home run early, but um, anyway, so we're not talking sports. Um, Plankton's here. We act. We have put any white cubes or time cubes. I always here. forget that. I do too. I need to. Okay, that and, should be on here. Yeah, and then you activate anything here. So if Plankton's present, plus one um, theft to any ingredients. So any ingredient, we're going to just put one on the bottom here, and I think that's it. Yeah. Okay, so now I get my dice, which are two red and one yellow. Thank you. I'm going to roll them. Oops, we'll roll that one again. We've got a arm, which is effort. We have BFF, which is friendship, and we have another arm here. So I can get the grubby grouper by spending one arm or one uh, effort and two effort. Uh, so once per turn, I'm going to be able to re-roll any dice. So I grab this. The time token goes away. I now have grubby grouper and um, SpongeBob on my team. I have one BFF. Um, which I cannot use to get, do anything, so I'm just going to burn that one. Oh, actually, I can I can re-roll it because so you place dice and then you re-roll. Um, if you ever do not place dice, you have to uh, burn a die anyway. So this one I can re-roll and try to get a uh, arm because then I could take away a cube from a friend. I have rolled an arm. Okay, uh, that is what is it? Effort. So from one of these, I can take away one time cube. I will take a time cube off Harold and Margaret Squarepants. <laughs> okay. uh, that's the end of my turn. I take away my token, and now it is Michelle's turn. Okay. So I'm going to place my team token somewhere. Um, I think maybe up there in the dining room. Okay. Okay. And then Daryl with one R is in the house. Thank you for joining us, Daryl. Flip and resolve a plankton card. Um, dining room. Oh. So it stays there. Oh, it goes there. Goes to the dining room, and this gets. Oh, second cube. theft token. Okay. Okay. And plankton's up there. Uh, all the friends get a time cube, one each. So Gary is oh. here. Gary. Harold and Maude. Okay. Oh no. Oh, Sandy okay, Cheese got Sandy three. Cheese. Uh oh. So one more. Yeah. Hey, why does little dog come to the door when it's always my turn? I know. Okay, so um, roll an assigned friend dice. So I have two reds and a green. Mm -hmm. Oh, we have to activate anything. If oh. Plankton is present, plus one. Sorry. Uh, while Michelle takes care of Bruno. If Plankton is present, plus one time for each uh, guitar friend here. Oh, no. So Sandy Cheeks is going to get a time cube. Also, all her spaces are full. Is it four? Yeah, oh no. Four. All right, friends, we've lost Sandy. Sandy Cheeks has been defeated by Plankton. Sorry, Sandy. Make up your mind, Bruno. I wonder what the timing is on that. Maybe Sandy, uh, maybe it's at the end of the turn. Friends, uh, so go ahead and continue with your turn, and I will. Some friends may want to draw. Okay, no. so I need to roll, right? Mm -hmm. I haven't rolled yet. Correct. Okay. Mm, excuse me. Okay. Oh, if at the end of the turn, so Sandy has not technically been defeated, folks. Okay. So you could take one of those off and save her. Uh, this is great. Oh, Daryl, thank you so much. I appreciate that. The Lakers <laughs> did win their 17th NBA championship last night, tying us with our heated rivals, the Boston Celtics. Um, this is great. Distant Battle says a Miss Opportuna. <laughs> I saw that. Nice. Well done. Okay. I gotta make sure. Okay. So for Sandy Cheeks, I need two guitars and one BFF. Mm -hmm. I have two BFFs and one guitar. Ooh. So should I just use that? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna do that. Okay. And then it says if you have a BFF friend, roll one red die. Okay, so that would be on a subsequent turn. Right? When you collect Sandy. When Sandy becomes a part of your team, you get that power. You don't get that okay. power now. Why not? I mean, oh. It's like on she has to be on your turn. team. She has to be on your team. Like she's still out like at the restaurant. But right I'm now. gonna take her because I, I have the, the Oh, you're right. Yeah. Oh, you collected. Yeah, yeah, you could totally do it then. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So go ahead and collect her just so um it's easy to see there. Thank okay, you. so these just go back here? Yep. Okay, nice. So Sandy. Uh, what do you spend again to do so that? So if you have a BFF friend. Which you do. Okay. 
Oh, wait. oh just kidding. It? No. Oh, it's Humphreys. an order. Uh, okay. <laughs> well, they can be my friend. Yeah. <laughs> Well, at least, I mean, yeah. Okay, so yeah. on a subsequent turn, yes. <laughs> I will get an extra red die. Nice, nice. Okay, and then, will that do me any good, this one? Here, I'm just going to roll it and yeah. see if it what? does me any good. So, two trophies? Ooh. Two, oh! Oh! So, I can do either the Krabby Patty with Coral Bits, or I can have Frankie Billy. Mm -hmm. Um. Do you have any food? Um, no, I no. just have uh, two okay. friends. Well, I'm gonna use this one then, so I can get the Krabby Patty with coral bits. Nice, that looks delicious. Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so okay. Michelle has completed two of the orders. We need to complete seven in order to win, and I believe that's your turn, right? Yes. Okay. Cool. Cool. Um, I'll go ahead and this refill this. Open the door. I know Bruno doesn't know if he wants to come in or come out. Well, it's I just don't sort know of where he went. Yeah. Okay. So now it's my turn. Um, let's go ahead and take your token off. Um, maybe I should try to get Harold and Margaret square pants. Okay, yeah, I'm going to go to the dining room. Now, could you do a plankton card for me, please? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay, chum bucket. Okay, so that means just goes off the board over here. Uh, the chum bucket is just off the uh, board space and... Uh, Plankton is like in his lab or whatever, doing doing dirt, bad stuff, whatever. <laughs> and then we add a theft cube to the lettuce and cheese. Okay, all right. Um, so he doesn't trigger any abilities. I am up here, so I get starting. My dice are uh, two, red. two red and a yellow. Thank you. Do you get extra dice? I do. So because of sponge, if I have at least one other. Effort friend, and here's my effort friend, Groupy Grouper. I get a yellow die. Grubby Grouper. Grubby Grouper. And then <laughs> Grubby. Grubby Grouper allows me to, um, what is it? Once per turn, I may re roll any number um, of dice before signing. So let's roll these four dice here. I've got a um, couple of BFFs, I've got um, a guitar, and a trophy. So the guitar is actually fun, the trophy is teamwork. The arm is effort, and the BFFs are friendship. Very friendly game, right, folks? What about you and Chad? Do you have friends? Let us know. <laughs> <laughs> and if you don't have friends, that's okay. We are your friends. You're our internet friends. Um, so I'm trying to get... Uh, I want three of the arms, which I don't have. I could hire... Um, I don't know what I do here. Whoops. Okay, and our mic just went off. Uh, Game Jedi friends, what's that? <laughs> okay, so what I've rolled here is uh, two BFFs, uh, one trophy, and one guitar. I could get that one, Flats the Flounder. But you know what? If you get one of those friends, they give you more abilities, I think, because you are you are the trophy one. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm going to try to get Margaret and uh, Harold. Or should I get Gary? Gary might be one, too. Okay. Oh, I like that. Okay, so I'm going to use my power of Grubby Grouper. Um, I may re-roll any dice, so I'm going to re-roll all of them. So I want to get a bunch of um, uh, effort symbols. And I did not. I got a bunch of trophies. Okay, well, what are you going to do? Um, so you got three trophies and a guitar. And a guitar. That's oh. one trophy there. You could get Frankie Billy. Yeah. Let me do... Uh, I'm going to try to get flats. So I need a guitar and... Or no, I need a trophy, is it? One trophy, one BFF. Okay. So I've assigned one die. Now I can re-roll all of them. Um, oh, there's the arm I needed, but I need a BFF? Yes. Okay, there it is. So I have uh, flats. Flounder is a friend of mine now. Um, so this goes here. He gets collected here. And then we refill. Ooh, the Krabby Patty. So now I can reroll. Again, if you don't um, assign a die on your turn, you must burn a die. But I've assigned two that last turn, so I don't have to burn anything. I've rolled a trophy. Oops, that was a trophy and a guitar. That is um, fun and uh, teamwork. 
I don't think that's going to get me anywhere. Oh, you know what? Let's let's try for Frankie Billy. I need one more um, teamwork token. And hey, there it Ooh. is, teamwork. Hey, folks, there's a lesson for you: teamwork. <laughs> okay. So now I have Frankie Billy and Flats the Flounder for my teams. Uh, once per turn, I may re-roll any dice before a So I basically have um, two re-rolls in my hand per turn. Oh, sweet. Yeah. And then this one, I, if I spend a trophy, I can take off um, one of these from the um, burger. Okay, so now I finish this by taking my team trophy back, and it is Michelle's turn. Okay. Thank you for joining us again, friends. This is Tabletop Tonight. My name is Ruel. I'm here with my wife, Michelle. We play games um, here on Twitch at 7 p.m. Pacific, Monday through Thursdays. You can also find me on Renegade Game Studios' uh, Twitch channels and also Facebook and all the other channels they do. Um, Thursday, uh, Actually, this week we're, we're off the air because Renegade Con was this weekend, but normally I, I play games with them on Thursdays. Um, I'm also on a Twitch uh, stream tomorrow at 3 p.m. Pacific with my friends John and Amanda. That is bored in East L.A. So please join us there. We just hang out, talk, and you know, play a game on, online. Really cool, really chill, just like this stream. So thank you so much for joining us. Okay, so if you have at least one other trophy, friend plus one green die. If you have a BFF, oh, I don't have either one of those. Okay. Okay, so we have this bad Oh, one. let's do the plankton thing first. I did. Oh, you did? Oh, my bad. Yeah. Where's plankton? In the dining room? Yes. And then did you add the tokens? I did not add the tokens. Okay, so one there. Okay, Harold and Maud, Margaret square pants are almost going to leave us. Uh, and then this says if plankton is present, plus one uh, theft to any ingredient. Let's just put it here on the mustard. And then if plankton is present, plus one to any ingredient. We will put one over here on the onions and tomatoes. Cool. Uh, Daryl B. Gaming, what's up? Thanks for joining us, Daryl. There's now two Daryls in the house. We got Daryl B. Gaming, Daryl with one R. Uh, Amanda is actually not in chat today. Um, Daryl, she is streaming on her channel. Uh, she's got a Twitch channel going on. She is playing macaron with um, Girls Game Shelf right now. So hopefully Amanda will stop by. Uh, Bruno doesn't know if he wants to come into the room or <laughs> he just wants to knock on the door, come in and leave. Just, just wants to make sure we're okay. I yeah. guess. Okay, so I have two trophies and an arm. So okay. there's two arms and a trophy. Um, oh, so you're trying to this row here, huh? In yeah. the kitchen, kitchen area. Did you get your extra dice? Did you? I don't think I get an extra you know, one. Extra well, if I have, if you have at least one other trophy friend, oh, so I have to, I have to get the trophy friend. Yeah, and then you have okay. Sandy, right? Sandy, that's if you have a fun friend. So if so, I have two trophy. Oh wait, just kidding. Okay, so there's two trophies right there. I'm gonna roll the other two to see if I can get that guitar. Yeah. So let me just uh, a little okay. closer look here, folks. If you notice, some of these have a two. So it's worth two trophies. Okay. Got oh, did you do it? Nice. I got it. Well done. Okay. So I have this one. So that means I can get an extra blue die on my next turn. Correct. correct? Yeah. Okay. Hi, sweet pug. Nice. Okay. The Flying Dutchman. Okay. And I have a BFF something. Okay. But I can't do anything. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, and if you notice, Man Ray, our first villain, folks. So the villain will trigger when Plankton goes into this area. And in order to place a time token, we need to hit these symbols. If we put two time tokens on this Man Ray, then we have defeated him or it. Um, you know, how many <laughs> orders have you play, uh, completed? Two. Two. I know the first one, you, you couldn't get a token because of the Plankton power. But the second one, we never gave you a spatula power. So go ahead and grab oh. a spatula. Okay. And this is just shared information. It oh. is. So Michelle has a trophy now. She can use it um, on her next turn, or I she can give it to me to use on my turn. It's just basically like a die that has been rolled to a trophy. Basically. Okay, so I can't do anything with this. So. Yep. Okay. Finished. Nice. All right. So now it's my turn. Could you do the plankton thing for me, please? Yeah. Thank you. Okay, so Chum Bucket. Okay, so he's coming off the board. Okay, and it goes on the that ketchup and mustard ketchup and mustard okay so we got we're still in pretty decent shape here folks again they take five and if you get five it doesn't go automatically you still have until the, the end of the turn to remove one of those cubes um oops sorry i i was supposed to go here first uh, i'm supposed to do my 
thing here first. Dining room or kitchen? Yeah, so uh, dining room because I want to try to uh, get Harold and uh, Margaret. Uh, so I get my dice. I start with two red, one yellow. I have at least one other friend here, so I get an additional yellow. And then I have two re-rolls. And then if I spend a trophy token, I can take a theft thing from uh, away from here. Uh, Distant Babble says, uh, no, Patrick, a mayonnaise is not an instrument. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Joby Gaming, if you're still around, uh, were you a SpongeBob fan? Throw some uh, SpongeBob references in there, my friend. Uh, I'm going to roll these here. So I've got an arm for effort, BFF for friendship, a trophy for teamwork, and another BFF for friendship. So I believe this one needs, yeah, three arms. So I'm going to keep this one. I'm going to use one of my re-rolls. So the Grubby Grouper, this is my first re-roll. So I'm keeping that arm. First re-roll. Come on, arm. There is another arm. And another one. Okay, cool. So I've done three. So I will take Harold and Margaret square pants. Is that You're the in arms. I've been, oh, my gosh. <laughs> um, so they are in my group now my team. So once per turn, I may turn any uh, arm into any face I want. Oh, the family's all together. Yeah. Are, mom are those, and dad. Okay, those are his parents. I was wondering about that. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Sponge, Sponge. <laughs> SpongeBob. Yeah, Sponge Square Bob. <laughs> uh, so my last die, it is a arm. I do have one more reroll. You have a trophy. Is there anything I can get for that? No. I could, oh, no. I need a two there to serve the crap. Crappy thing. Okay. Crusty, crab Crusty pizza. crabby pizza. Um, okay. I'll tell you what. My final die, I'm going to use uh, SpongeBob's ability. I can spend one of these to remove a uh, time token. So Gary will have a little more time to hang out. And that is the end of my turn. I take okay. this away. Okay. And it's Michelle's turn. Okay. So I'm going to place my team token somewhere. Um none of my peeps out here okay you know i'm gonna go to the kitchen let's go into the kitchen i'm going to the kitchen okay so uh, homie's in the kitchen okay and puts a theft token is at the bottom patty yeah okay, so there are three there now hold on bruno's chewing on something uh oh <laughs> hey and bruno just had his dinner too i don't know why he's chewing i think he's just i think he's just trying to be a little busybody dog here are you bored here. Bruno, we're gonna say hi to our friends. So Bruno is going to make an appearance, friends. So thank you for sticking around. There is our pug. Whoa. He's like, what? Hi. Hey, Bruno. Say hi to the people. Say hi to your friends. There is the Bruno pug. Drop those emotes in chat, folks. There is Bruno. Yay, Twin oh. Flower. Thank you for hanging out. There are all of the Bruno emotes. I don't want to cover your face. Bruno, how are you? What's up, buddy? How come you keep going in and out of the room okay, today? So I'm gonna roll my dice. So I have two red and one green, and I get an extra somewhere. Oh, wait, no, that's if I have a BFF friend. Oh, do you have a, a BFF, BFF friend? I do not. What's the, oh, that's, that's the order. Trophy. Okay. Yeah. Okay, it's my trophy friend. Trophy friend. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to roll these dice. Yeah. Okay, so I got, oh, you want to go down now? Yeah. Okay, so Okay, there goes Bruno. Oh, uh, let's sorry, get the oh. order oh. back out of here. Okay. Okay. So I got a Hi, trophy, Bruno. two BFFs, and an arm. Okay, so well, that's not like oh, but I can also count this, which is not going to help me. Is that another raid? There is another raid. <laughs> Thank you, Kestrel Five Bing Bong. Is that from Team Bing Bong? <laughs> yes. Welcome, Raiders. Oh, I'm getting the raiding boy. hat while Michelle takes her turn. Okay. Uh, so Let's try to figure out what the heck I can do yeah. here. I believe that's the uh, Brothers Murph. I want to thank all the Raiders coming in here. We got the rain hat. Thank you, Raiders. Raid. Uh, my name is Ruel Gaviola. This is my wife, Michelle. Hello. We play games here on Twitch. Our Twitch channel, we do Tabletop tonight, Monday through Thursday, 7 p.m. Pacific. want to thank you all for coming in and hanging out with us. We've got a fun one uh, today. We've got Plankton Rising from The Up, who sponsored this episode. Uh, we are in Bikini Bottom, uh, hanging out with SpongeBob and Squidward and all the friends here and a brother's murph i'm not you know just because of the brother's murph they did lakers suck no where's no. amanda with the band hammer no yeah yeah <laughs> just for nick and mike murphy this is the <laughs> la laker channel friends home of the 17 time nba champions they are now tied with the 
hated Boston Celtics for the most titles in NBA history with 17. Uh, thank you all for joining us. Uh, yes, I am still going to be talking about this Laker victory uh, for the next year or so until the next season starts, which actually I think they start in December this time. It's crazy. It's the longest NBA season ever. And again, the correct team won the championship. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, okay, yeah. Hey, man, I'm Team LeBron. Let's go, Laker. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Brothers Burst, for the raid. And thanks for hanging out, friends. Love LeBron. Love the Lakers. Um, it's just in incredible, incredible season. One of the bright spots of the year, right? Um, we didn't think we were going to have sports again this year, but thanks to the NBA, for they did it right. Uh, I don't believe there was if they might have had one case of coronavirus, but they did the bubble thing correctly. I mean, you didn't hear not, not like baseball or football where they've had to cancel postpone games. No, the Lakers, I mean the NBA, they were they were smart about it. Um, yes, uh, all day. I hope they win like four more than re LeBron retires in Lakers. Well, I, I like the four four more championships before LeBron retires. I'm just gonna ignore the rest of that sentence, but uh, I appreciate the sentiment. <laughs> um, was I supposed to put something on this? Uh, Man Ray, no. So Man Ray, um, where did, oh, Plankton was supposed to put cubes on the other friends. Okay. Did I, I don't even remember if I did. Yeah, that would be the third okay. on Mrs. Puff. And then uh, Man Ray's uh, ability is going to trigger, which is okay. if Plankton is present, plus one theft to any ingredient. So I'm going to add a theft here. Uh, we'll put it on the pickles since there's only one. So each of these has two. The bottom patty has three now, so we need to be careful of that. Uh, Meepo overboard. Hey, thanks for just uh, hang for hanging out, coming back. Welcome back. Um, <laughs> Meepo overboard. Just came back. Sorry, I had to go spend time with my dang family. <laughs> Appreciate the sacrifice, my friend. Um, so while Michelle takes her turn, let's not forget that the Lakers won their 17th NBA championship <laughs> last night. It's a great feat. Um, that dang family. So Keshel, thanks for hanging out, friend. Oh, wait. You know what? I was supposed to add a die. Yeah. A blue die. Yeah. Okay. So go ahead and roll the extra blue die. Okay. And I don't... What did I have? Because I had a, an extra one left over. Yeah. What did you roll get? You at, just added this turn. It was the... Okay, so you I served got, that. Yeah. So I got um, the arm and a BFF. Okay. Okay. And then I don't remember what... So normally you was. start with these dice. Two a red and a green. Uh-huh. And I think it was a red and a green. Okay. So we go ahead and take the other one, and you have your blue one. Okay. All right. Okay. Cool, cool. Okay, so I have two BFFs. Okay. Is that going to give me anything? No. <laughs> the one that you just served, you just served that Krusty Burger one? Yeah, or, the Krabby Patty? Krabby Patty? Go ahead and grab a spatula token. Well, maybe that'll help me out. That might help you out. Okay, that's a third BFF ring, which is uh, still not going to help me. Okay. Okay. So, so you're going to have to burn one die. Okay. Did I get to roll this, but it's not going to make a difference. Yeah, so you can just end your turn. Okay. <laughs> no, actually, you know what? You might want to roll oh, because okay. you, you have tokens to use as well. Oh, okay. Right? Yeah, so roll and see what okay. happens. Let's try to shake that. <laughs> okay, so it's an arm. Okay. So an arm. The only other thing I can use is the guitar. Mm-hmm. And I don't have one. Okay. Okay. So <laughs> good turn. Good turn. Yeah. Right. So again, we are playing Plankton Rising. This will be out November 10th. It is now available for pre order, as you see here on the bottom of the screen from the op. Uh, could we do, uh, let me give you a token back. Can we do the Plankton card, please? Oh, wait. Do I? No, I placed my team card, my team token first. I'm going to try to serve one of those Krabby Patties. So I'm going to go to the dining room. Oh. Okay. Now this. Yes. Thank you. Okay, so you are in the dining room, okay. and the mustard and ketchup gets uh -oh. a little token. There's three there. Okay, and then SpongeBob gets two red, one yellow, and I have a friend, so I get an additional yellow. Okay, let me roll these. Uh, let's see the comments real quick. Just about served a Ruel with cheese. Uh, oh. Dang it, I meant a Royale with cheese. <laughs> Ruel with cheese. I like that. I like that. Nice one. Just oh, I was supposed to get another die, too. Uh-oh. All right. Well. Okay. We'll make it up next time. Yeah. Okay. Here's my roll. So I've got, um, looks like a effort. That's the one with the two. So I've got two arms, a third arm, a trophy. And, okay, so the guitar is fun. The trophy is teamwork. 
Uh, so I can get, um, I can serve one of those Krabby Patties. Is that the one with the two? Yes. So two of those and a guitar. Oh, I forgot to add the time, darn it. So this one goes there. Oh, yeah, that's it. Um, <laughs> Grizzly Diz, nice. Uh, I was getting real tired of these three themes, and then they go and make SpongeBob. Might be making a mistake here, anime. Yeah, <laughs> it is now available for pre-order, my friend. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna, you know, I if you want to do it, cool. If not, you know, appreciate it. But yeah, um, so I'm going to be serving the Krabby Patty. So um, we already did that ability. Oh, you know what? We didn't. Um, Crab. Uh, we were supposed to trigger all of these. So it's one, two, three Ooh. tokens we're going to be spending. Uh, so one, two, oh boy. So three there. This is to any ingredient, right? Yeah, so I got to choose. I'm just trying to line uh. them up. So Okay. But I have served this. And I do, once per turn, I may re-roll any dice before assigning. Um, what I can do is spend. Uh, once per turn, I may change that to any face. Um, if I have, I can take off, uh, for trophies, I can take off one of these. So I'm going to spend one trophy. I'll take it off the bottom patty. And then I have a, an arm. I'm going to take the arm and use it to heal, uh, to take one of these time things off Mrs. Puff. Okay. Um, I believe that's the end of my turn. I'm so excited to get Disney Plus. Oh, okay. I haven't seen Gr Gravity Falls yet. Uh, just in Babel, yeah, it's Bruno and a bunch of burgers. <laughs> pretty much on, on brand with Bruno. Uh, so we have served, how many have we served? I've served one Krabby Patty. I've got three. Okay, so we're halfway home, folks. we got four items we've served. Uh, it is Michelle's turn now. Wait, we have to get seven, seven to okay. win. Okay, in my head, I, I was thinking ten. Yeah, uh, okay. it's ten. If we get ten friends defeated, then we lose the game. Okay. Okay. So what do I want to do? I'm going to serve some of these. Uh... Meeple, the whole show is made. It has an uh, ending, like a great one. Oh, nice. Okay. Now you got you got me uh, interested in Gravity Falls, folks. Okay. So he's got to go to the kitchen. Okay. I'm going to cube on the lettuce. <gasps> oh. Uh oh. Okay. Stealing our recipes. Yep. And then add a cube to Mrs. Puff, which, which is the one I just took off. So. Aww. And then trigger all the abilities for the other stuff. So kelp shake. If plankton is present, no friends can be made here unless the order is completed. Unless this order. So you got to complete this order in order to get friend become friends with Mrs. Okay. Puff. Okay. And Krabby Patty, if plankton is present, um, plus one to any ingredient. Ooh. Oh. The top ones have two. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And then trigger the villain. Okay, Manly. if plankton is present, add one to any ingredient. Ugh. Oh, thanks, uh, Wannabe Kiwi. So good, really makes me laugh. So worthwhile. I'm going to have okay. to check that out. So roll and assign friend dice. Okay, so I'm going to need my two red and green. Then I get a blue one. Nice. And if you have at least one other trophy friend... A green one. Okay. Nice. And then I have those two extra things there. Oh, all right. So okay. you can... Hopefully I get something. So remember, yeah, you could, you have to complete this one if, if you want to get a Mrs. Puff's friend. Okay. So let's see. That is three guitars. Okay. So I have one, Ooh. two trophies, a guitar, and two BFF. You know, I think those are BFF rings. Um, But... Well, yeah, I'm going to need the guitar. But I have a thing here mm -hmm. for this. If you roll... Oh, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> it says if you roll three or more trophies on your first roll, shuffle any lost friend into the draw pile. Oh, okay. wow. So this I can use here. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I don't know, what do you think? Should I just reroll everything? Uh, yeah, don't forget you do have tokens to use if you'd like. Well, um... I need, I'm going to need um, a guitar. One guitar. Yeah. Now to def to put one of the time tokens on Man Ray, we need to put two on him to defeat him. You would need two BFFs and two guitars. Two BFFs. Yeah, you could technically add a time token to him now, which will give you another spatula. 
Well, I need two guitars though, and I don't. Oh, just kidding. That's two. Yeah. Again, your choice. Okay. Um, no, you know what? We got to get rid of him. Yeah. Get rid of the evil. Yes. Okay. So that's that, and then that. Well, does this you like can go use that away? Instead. No, you can use that instead <gasps> oh, if you would like. That way, you save okay. your dice. Nice. Okay. So that takes care of the evil. Yep. So you put okay. one of those. He needs two to go away. Okay. But you do get a that spatula you've used. Just go ahead and discard it. Oh, I thought I got to keep it again. No, no, you. It's a one-time use. Oh, that's yeah. what my question was. Okay. Oh, my bad. I, I misunderstood. Okay. But here's the cool thing: because you put a time token on Man Ray, you get another special token for free. Okay. Yep. Now this one you can you can't use this turn. That one's you use on the next turn. Okay. okay. So you have used those done. guys. Nice, nice. Ah. Okay. So. <laughs> I don't know what should I do. Uh, should I just reroll all of them? Yeah, unless I mean, yeah, because the trophies aren't really out there in this row. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I got a BFF, an arm, and another BFF. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so there's an arm and a trophy. Okay. Oh wait, no, I need two arms, so I can get Mrs. Puff. Oh, cool. Okay, so that's my two. Oh, arm. wait, wait. That arm you, is because you got this turn. You, you have to wait till next turn to use that. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Okay. Ah. Okay, you well, do I have that to... trophy um, token. That one you may use. Yeah, but I need the arm. And I don't have any arm. Oh, I only have this one. Oh, got it, got it, got it. So I can still reroll this, no? Absolutely. Okay, yeah. so I have the trophy and an arm. I just need one more arm. Nice. Like the odds, folks. Let's see what we got. I didn't get an arm. Okay. So um, what you do, you're going to burn one die and then roll the final one. Okay. Good luck. Come on. Arm, arm, arm. arm! Yes! She did okay, it. She so did it. I got that. Nice. So this gets tossed in the washer. Yep. Okay. And then Mrs. Puff. Away. I have Mrs. Puff on my team. Right. Oh. So if you have a trophy friend, you get a yellow die. Oh, I get all kinds wow, of yeah. extra Wow, yeah. Nice. Ones. Yeah. And that's what's cool. This is like the other rising games where, you know, you're building up your team or adding, you know, cards to your hand and that's going to get you the more dice and more abilities. So very nice. Good turn. Okay. Um now, one thing I did forget when I served that Krabby Patty, I did never I never got my spatula. So could you have me a spatula, please? Mm -hmm. So this is actually uh, remove any one um, oh, thing from an ingredient. Because I got this on a previous turn, I'm going to use it this turn, folks. So, But first, let's start here. I'm going to go to, uh, let's see, how many? We have one. I've served one. You've served three? Three, yes. Okay. Um, I'm going to go down here to the kitchen. Uh, could you do a plankton card, mm -hmm. please? Let's see where plankton goes. Um, chum bucket. Okay, so off here. And this goes on the bottom. Okay. Uh, so let me get my dice. Um, I've got two red, one yellow. I have another friend here, so I got another yellow. And I have two rerolls. And then once per turn, I may turn a arm into any face. So I really want to try to uh, serve some of these. Let's Let's try to... So I'm going to use this one here. Remove any one um, theft from ingredient. I'm going to move, remove this one. So we got a little breathing room. That goes away. Okay. So I've got a bunch of BFFs. Yeah, they're all friendship. Any friendship here? Um, oh, okay. Let's assign one friendship to Man Ray, and hopefully I can get two guitars. Um, okay. So let's try to get a guitar. I think the guitars are most prevalent here on the blue ones. Oh, they're all the same? Yeah, so there's a chart here oh. that, yeah, has it, which, of course, we should be consulting, but it's all good. Uh, I just assume they were all the same. Right? Oh, okay, so once per turn, I may change one of these to any face. So I'm going to change this to a guitar. Okay. Yeah, so I've used that. That's Harold and Margaret Squarepants power. Uh, once per turn, I may reroll any dice before assigning. So I'm already assigned, so I'm just going to take my final, or I'm going to roll these. Come on, guitar. There is the final guitar. So Woo pew, pew, pew. Uh, <laughs> Man Ray gets hit, and I get a uh, token. Uh, next turn, I can remove one time from two different friends. Uh, I have defeated the evil Man Ray. Bye-bye, Man Ray. Um, so that just goes away. I do have one more die. Let me, I'm just going to roll it and see what I, I have a trophy. 
That doesn't really do anything. I mean, I could ask you to use your arm there. Trophy in arm? Oh, you can get that Krabby Patty. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, right. May I have your arm, please? Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> okay, so we I have served the Krabby Patty. I have served something. So because I served something, I get another token. Let's be for next turn. It's a hey, an arm that I can share with you. Uh, we I have served two things here, Michelle. So I've got three still. Five out of the seven necessary to win, folks. So we're getting a little closer. Um, thank you. Mm -hmm. And let's get good old Plankton back. Or Michelle's going to go onto the board first. Okay. Um, what do I want? Um. <laughs> All right, I guess I'll go into the dining room. Haven't been there for a while. Okay. Okay, chum bucket. Okay, so plankton so, stays off the board. And then what do we add the theft token to? Was it onions and tomatoes? Or what? Is it? Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> totally disregarded that. <laughs> yes, the onions and tomatoes. So they're all at three each right now, all six. Okay. So again, uh, for um, plankton, when he has to convert all six. So I get my two red, my one green. Oh, yeah, all kinds of dice. Nice. Yellow, blue, another green. Okay. Wow. That one, if you have, oh, I don't have a BFF friend. Okay. She'll have six dice, folks. <laughs> okay, I better get something. Yeah. So we have five orders. If you can serve two orders this turn, we win. Okay, let's see what's up here. Okay. I, I do have an arm just in case. Okay, so that Krabby, the double Krabby Patty, it's two BFFs. Who doesn't like a good double double, okay, right, folks? Two BFFs. Oh, and there's two guitars. Yes. Okay, and the other one is a trophy and two guitars. Okay. Okay, I don't have that. Oh, oh, but What's there's the... pizza. Okay. Okay, so that's two arm. Oh! Got it. Okay, so do you want to use this arm? Just yes, in case? I do. Okay, there's okay, a... so hold on. Okay, okay, so this is the two BFFs mm -hmm. and the one guitar. Okay, okay, and then the crusty crab pizza is two arms, so I need that and a trophy. Is that it? That's it. So Michelle has served uh, two of those, you have three already, I have two here. Three plus two plus two is seven. We did it. <laughs> Good job, folks. We have won the game thanks to Michelle's excellent dice rolling skills there. And, uh, yeah, we've won. Yay! That is Plankton Rising from the op. Uh, we have defeated Plankton and his plan to take over uh, Bikini Bottom. Uh, so, as you saw here, the final one here, the Double Krabby Patty, the Krusty Krab Pizza. Michelle rolled all those, plus she used one of my tokens because you can share in this game. Um, people overboard ask, so is this theme, uh, re -theme mostly the same as the other XYZ Rises game? Or is it, uh, it's mostly the same. I would call this um, a more family-friendly version because instead of three locations, you only have two. And then also, I think it's a little more forgiving as far as you know what Plankton does. Like he just, you know, he adds over here and he has to get all six of these. So it doesn't dial up as fast. Now you can, of course, increase the difficulty by adding in more um, villains. We played with the standard. I think it was like two villains out of the four. Um, there's definitely fewer villains in this as far as like bad stuff happening because I felt like with the Avengers one, that one was like turn one. It's like, oh my gosh, Thanos is going to win. You know, it's, it's, it's like really <laughs> fast. And same with the uh, Harry Potter one. I thought that was a little more difficult. So this for sure is a family-friendly version. I like it. I, this one, I feel like it's a little more streamlined. It's not as like uh, a fiddly, I guess, as the other ones. Um, how do you feel about? I mean, this is a fun little game, right? For yeah, we could play this with our nephew and nieces, right? Yeah, you know. Yeah, I think that um, because it's SpongeBob, uh -huh. like it, it doesn't look real like um, intimidating. Yeah, it's Can definitely you? like uh, more approachable, right? Yeah, as yeah, far, for yeah, sure. for yeah. So yeah, uh, I would <laughs> I would highly recommend it for uh, friends for uh, definitely family. This one has a. Uh, we did it, Patrick. We saved the city. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you defeated the heat. I mean, planted, right? Uh, thank you, Chris, for hanging out. Um, Distant Battle says, my sandwich tastes like a fried boot. My sandwich is a fried boot. <laughs> I, I don't know any. I, I know some SpongeBob, but uh, that's that's pretty much what you're going to get from me. <laughs> uh, 
Friends, we want to thank you again for hanging out, especially everyone who rated as well. Thank you. Really appreciate you hanging out with us uh, today. And um, I want to thank the op, uh, especially Ross over uh, there at the op. Thank you, my friend, for sending over the game and also for sponsoring um, this stream. Um, tomorrow, I've got a really special night uh, planned with some of my friends from Renegade. We're going to play a game. Now, we're not going to do uh, Renegade stuff. This is here on a Tabletop tonight. I've got Victor, Irene, Heidi, and Desiree also. She's going to come out from behind the camera and join us on camera. Uh, we're going to play Carcassonne over on Board Game Arena, so we're going to stream it here. So please come back 7 p.m. tomorrow. They're really great people. I love working with the Renegade crew. Um, so we're going to hang out, chit-chat a little bit, and then play a game as well. Uh, Meepo over, thank you. Slivers, thank you. Good night, my friend. Also, um, who else we got? Uh, well, everyone. Fried chickens, wannabe kiwi, um, slivers, as we saw, distant babble. Um, I want to make a grizzly diz. Devil's on our Daygill. I forgot to say hi to Daygill earlier. Um, you know, all, all of our regulars as well. Much appreciated. Slackfish as always. Uh, always, always good times here. So everyone have a great night. Uh, we'll be back tomorrow. Let me see if there's anything else I need to throw out here. Um, you know what? If you want to raise, oh, uh, tomorrow, board in East LA, three o'clock Pacific, but seven o'clock Pacific here. Um, and then well, let's, let's try to raid someone. If anyone's available, hang out here. I'm going to shut this down and we're going to be raiding. Anything less words before we get out of here, babe? No, no, okay. this is fun. Yeah, good game. Stay safe. We'll see you later. Hang out and chat if you want to rate. All right. Bye, everybody. Bye.